name is Bella Swenson, and I'm a sixth grader at Glen Middle School. And this past summer was the first time I was able to go to the gathering place. And I have like older friends that got to go a whole entire year before me, and they would tell me about the people and the worship and the fun. And they would also tell me that almost every time you went, you were either impacted by a word, a verse, a song, even the speaker. And every time they told me that, I would always think to myself, oh, they, they're probably exaggerating a little bit. I mean, every time, anything. <laughs> but <laughs> finally it came last summer to where I could go, and I can't explain to you how excited I was. But every time I went, it was so true. What they told me, I was impacted by everything, anything. But there was this one night that changed the way I thought of myself. And there was this man, and he's a poetic speaker. And he started out his message with a song called You Are Beautiful by Christina Aguilera. And the song talks about, I mean, she's basically telling you throughout the whole entire song that you are beautiful and that you should love yourself. And when you know sticks and stones break your bones, then you can get up. And when words hurt you, then you can get up. But that wasn't me. I didn't love myself. I didn't think I was beautiful. And when people hurt me with words and emotions, I um, didn't get up. And to top it all off, I didn't think that God loved me. And I didn't think that God thought I was beautiful. So I always kept like my feelings to myself. And I didn't reach out to my savior. But this one man in this one night changed that. And I now love myself because of the gathering place. And I can't thank you all enough.